Welcome back to another episode of the Call of Duty World War II Top 5 Fails, sponsored by Green Man Gaming. And as always, if you use my affiliate link down in the description, you'll save some money on your games. Kicking off our countdown at the number 5 spot are some hit marker clips. First, Mega GH Rocker Double Zero should be getting headshots, but instead is getting hit markers there. DD Warrior gets a point blank hit marker with the shotgun. Joe Owens Chumps follows up with another point blank hit marker with a blunderbuss this time. If you can't get that kill at that range with a blunderbuss, then what the fuck is the point of using it? And at the number four spot, we got some laggy deaths. First, Taylor Burns here sees this guy skip forward in fucking time to kill him. There's no way that that's a two bar. Check out the kill cam here. It just looks like he's teleporting all over the goddamn map. Then is a nice roach who sees this guy go from one side of the fucking building to the other here. Check out this kill cam. It's like watching a goddamn flip book. If your internet is that fucking shitty, you shouldn't even be allowed to play this game. J Team's 07 sees this sniper walk through a fucking wall and then turn around and teleport behind him to kill him. What the fuck was that shit? Last leader Kaiser SVP's game is skipping around like Little Red Riding Hood. Look at this bullshit. Of course, he's pissed off that the game's lagging, throws out a care package, but then when it comes in, it actually tumbles through the fucking truck right there. Are you fucking serious? How does a care package go through a solid goddamn object? And at the bronze medal spot, got a pair of bad spawns and cross maps. First, sees the day dies, respawns, takes a few steps, and then gets hit by a throwing knife coming from all the way on the other side of the map. The person in the game chat is pretty excited about it, though. Then X-Man 90 is gonna die, and then respawn with the throwing knife out of nowhere! Check this shit out, the ballerina just tosses up the throwing knife, and the game spawns X-Man 90 right underneath the projectile. How in the fuck is that a safe spawn? And at the runner-up spot is NL Messi 10 who calls in a glide bomb and his eyes light up when he sees three players on the Charlie objective, but it's a fucking dud! He gets none of those three! Holy shit, the score streaks suck in this game! But in our number one spot are a pair of fucked up plays of the game first. Payetta gets a sick feed here. However, the camera detaches from the soldier's body for kills number three and four and then finally goes back for kill number five. What in the shit is that, Sledgehammer? However, Chris the Great One shows off the worst Bronze Star kill cam I've ever seen right here. This guy just punches him in the side, gets killed by a shotgun, and as he respawns, he ends up getting a plus 40 for a kill assist, and that, my friends in fuck nuggets, is the goddamn play of the game. Are you fucking shitting me, Sledgehammer? Something is fucked up with your algorithm to have that garbage be the play of the game. He didn't even kill anybody. The Black Ops 4 beta is starting this weekend, so if you guys have any clips for either the top five plays or top five fails from Black Ops 4, be sure to send them in thuswants27 at gmail.com with that subject and be sure to include your channel so that I give you proper credit. Also, once the beta is over, we're going to be doing multiple Call of Duty top fives from here on out until Black Ops 4 drops in October. So be sure to send in any clips that you have for either the top five fails or the Call of Duty top five plays.